It was a scintillating game last night, and the Delhi Capitals got over the top of Sunrisers Hyderabad. We're going to review that game, but we're also going to take a look at the Delhi Capitals taking on CSK for a place in the final. That's up next on Hogs Vlog. Now, firstly, well done to Prithiv Shaw. What a fantastic performance. Under pressure, struggling for runs, and he comes out and take, uh, makes a 50 in a final. That was pressure situation, and full credit to the young fella. He took the initiative, he took the game away from Sunrisers Hyderabad, and put Delhi Capitals in a dominant position. Now, after doing that, Pant came out and made a fantastic 49. But I am going to get stuck into him. The reason why he's not in the World Cup squad for uh, India going to England is because he doesn't finish matches. Ricky Ponning got off his chair after he got out. They needed something like five off seven deliveries and he wanted to be the hero, play the big shot. And what happened? He lost his wicket and Delhi Capitals nearly lost the game. Now that moves me on to VJ Shankar. VJ Shankar, you're in that Indian squad for the World Cup in England. Now, Delhi Capitals needed two off two balls. It's a short ball, it's been pulled by Paul. You're running around on the boundary. The ball lands a foot in front of you. You don't dive, you don't give it a half chance. It was a simple catch that could have been taken for a player of your standard. I'm not worried about not taking the catch or dropping the catch, it was the effort in a pressure situation, or not even pressure situation. It doesn't matter what moment of the game. You've got to take those or have a crack at those half chances. So VJ Shankar, that was a final moment for SRH in this tournament, and you did not give the effort. Okay, moving on to the next game. The Delhi Capitals have got the opportunity against CSK, but I think they are on the back foot because CSK have beaten them twice in the tournament so far. Now the changes for Delhi Capitals in this match, they have to bring in Ingram for Munro. Munro's got no idea against spin, and CSK have got the quality spinners of Harbhajan Singh, Jadav, uh, I mean Jadeja, and also Tahir, the leading wicket taker for CSK. Now Jadav, who I've just mentioned, has got the shoulder injury, he's not coming back. So they'll have to go in with the same batting order that they did before. But I like their strength. They only need to probably make about 130, 140 against this Delhi Capitals batting lineup with the spin attack they've got. If you looked out the wicket, both teams struggled facing spin. CSK have got three spinners. Delhi Capitals have only got two. And that is where the game is going to be won and lost. Anyway, that's Hogs Vlog. If you want to subscribe to me, subscribe downstairs. If you like what I'm doing, you want to get uh, notifications, well, put your uh, sign up on that little bell down there. I'll see you later, and good luck to CSK. I think they're going to go over the top of Delhi Capitals, but full credit to both of them, and good luck to whoever gets through to the final.